We're going to start with our batter. batter. This is beer batter. Okay? I got... Johnny, watch, well, you don't have to eat it. Don't so, this is beer batter. Sorry. Get that person out of here. And what we're going to do is we're going to add in three-quarter cup of beer. Dark, positive vibes. I like what you said. Exactly. Look. Okay, pumpkins? That's what we're doing here. Thank you. Doesn't Tony look amazing? I don't know. Hold on. I got to see the... I need three quarters of a cup. Let it settle. Oh, I gotta let the head go down because I didn't. I didn't do it properly. You really want to tilt so that there won't be so much head. So What's we'll let the head? huh? What's wrong with a lot of head? Not for your beer. You don't want that. Mm -hmm. So we'll, we'll let we'll, we'll go ahead and let that sit for a second. I didn't intend for that to happen. So. Well, well, it'll settle. Yeah, it'll settle. If you do the salt thing, it'll kill it, right? Yeah, but I don't... Well, yeah, you can put a little salt in here because I'll put salt in there anyway. Yeah. That's so, some people some people use their finger, which is nasty because other people are eating from it. So, we're going to add just a tad bit of salt to get rid of... It, the head is going away anyway, so... Go ahead and just put a little salt on that. There you go. Head go down a little bit. Boom. Okay. So, we're going to take this. It's a little bit more than three quarters of a cup. And we're just going to make the batter. So if it's beer batter, why do you have to add beer? Because that's what, that's what makes it beer batter, because you're adding beer. Oh, so it's batter, but it's not. Yeah, because if, if you don't want beer in it, you can add. It you can just add water. It doesn't come that way. Yeah. Gotcha. Hey, South Carolina. Hey, Baltimore. We just left, we just left Baltimore and D.C. Yep, just got back last night. We just got back. A little more. Sharon Brown, you too. Thank you. Thank you, Marilyn. Well, so because I'm going to make um, Braden Roche. Because you. I'm going to make the cilantro, uh, lime cilantro. Sweetheart, uh, love. Thank you. Where's the beer? I didn't get that out of the way. The camera. A little bit more. Just a little too tight still, and then the rest you gotta drink. No, I'm gonna put it there. It'll be in the way of the camera. Sorry, Mike. I'm just going to stir. And stir, and stir, and stir. Okay. There we go. Now, Vaughn can finish stirring this mm -hmm. while I... Yeah, I like my batter really thick, too, guys, by the way. Mmm. So, Vaughn's going to finish stirring this. Hey, Jen. Anybody that's ignorant, just block them, please. Okay, thank you. I'm not going to first season the shrimp. Don't need them. Okay. Who's joining us for dinner? Um, oh, just joining for dinner. Yeah, we're doing street tacos. Oh, yeah. So we're going to put some Obey. We have some people joining later. <laughs> and yum, and you're welcome. Uh, So Kinder's caramelized onion and butter. It's a lot of seasoning. It's not a lot of seasoning because I didn't season the batter. Oh, I'm putting shrimp in there. The steak didn't go Buttery, in Buttery, garlic, and herb. The steak didn't go in here, right? No, th I'm, I'm not going batter. I no. Don't, I, don't, I don't know. What and then doing. the buttery steak, guys. Now I'm going to put these same exact seasonings on my um, cod. Mm hmm. Do we have enough cod and everything, but We do. I'm gonna massage this up real good. You hear your ice maker? Yes, I do hear my ice maker. That's how I got me, yes. So, the reason that we have an outdoor ice maker is because this woman uses so much ice throughout the day and night and that we oftentimes run out. The rest of us don't have ice. So, her sister, well, she, her sister came over and she couldn't get any ice, so she sent her an outboard ice machine. Yay! I'm very excited about it. And I'm using that ice right now. Just test it. And I'm going to do the same thing with my cod. Okay? A little bit of obey. Yep, it's cold. Yes, this is cold. This, cold. this is cold. Is, what cold. is the ice cold? Ice is cold. What? 
It's ice. It's supposed to be cold. I'm just confirming. Oh, that was a little too much, but it's all right. No, it's not. A little bit more of this. And then... Cod is usually used for like fish and chips, things like that. It's a white meat, but it's very, it's a meaty white meat. And I'm gonna give this a little, where can I find the, the garlic butter candy? Let me tell you about the, what, uh, actually, you can get it at K. Roger. Or oh, Kroger. Ha ha ha, it's the same thing, K. Roger. Um, you can get it at your, at your friendly neighborhood store, but I go, to, I go to K. Roger, and I get mine. Here's the steak. I thought it was going to fall, but say, oh, Lord. It has minced garlic, olive oil as a base, minced garlic, uh, Himalayan sea salt, and pepper. That's it. Nothing else. Okay, so as you guys can see, everything is seasoned very nicely, but not overly seasoned. So I said that your steak looks scrumptious. Can, Ooh, yes, 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 Benny G. Hello, Benny G. Thank you for thank you for your donation. Yes, I do a homemade mac and cheese. As a matter of fact, for uh, Easter dinner, my son sent me a text today. He said, "Mom, are you making Easter dinner?" So I'm making oxtail, fried chicken, macaroni and cheese, um, candy yams, and collard greens, and I'm gonna bake a loaf of bread. You don't so. complain yesterday. You said you're making oxtails today. Well, I would rather do it for because um, it's almost. When is Easter? On April, I mean March 31st, the day after Caleb's oh, right birthday. Here. Okay, so this week. So, right. yeah. So, hey, Dee. Oh, yesterday was Palm Palm Sunday. Hey, guys. Diesel. Okay, so that's that's good. That's good for that. So we're gonna uh, fry Palm these. says we look blurry. What, what do you think that is? You know, can you see it too, Mike? Okay. It could be internet speed or something like that. Where's my phone? Make sure I turn that thing off. No eating for you. Why? I'm, oh, I was thinking. I was thinking about banana pudding, but I'm gonna tell you what. If I make banana pudding, I would only be making it for like me and the boys because Vaughn doesn't like banana pudding. He doesn't like that consistency. And of course, we're making street tacos, so you gotta have a margarita. Yeah, it's delicious. So we're gonna go ahead and since they're both fish, we're gonna fry them together. Okay. So maybe try maybe try wiping the lenses in a little bur blurry. So like three people said it's blurry, Mike. It, hey, it, we just have to wait a second, y'all. I'm sorry. Do this. Come on. Hey! hey. <laughs> How is you? How are you? Good. How are you? <laughs> hey. hey. Come on. These are our neighbors. I love them. Okay. We gotta introduce them. Can't just say these are okay. our neighbors. Well, you you go ahead and explain this. <laughs> Shantae. Shantae. Hi. And Gerard. Because I'm the real Shantae. Roxanne, <laughs> Roxanne. Mm -hmm. oh, can't you understand? <laughs> <laughs> so you guys are going to be uh, tasting, testing street tacos. Yes, yeah, so shrimp, cod, cod, and shrimp steak. Things. Okay. All right. Okay. Cool. And then you'll have All to be right, part, awesome. and then you'll have to go ahead and have a seat over there. You'll Is have, there margaritas? You'll have to, um, yeah. yeah. You want a margarita? Yes. Okay. All right, so Vaughn Mom, Mom will take care of the margaritas with the yeah. neighbors. Do we have margarita pups? And then on top of it, I want to talk to you because I know you met Jackie. She told me. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and turn this heat up. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Who calling? That's Dang it. Who That's the production that? company calling. They have to call back later. Sorry, Com. Got to call you later. Yeah, you know, you know what we do on Mondays. All right, so that's nice and warm. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna batter these. Yes, dear. Do I need to do anything to this? Is it melted or something? Yeah, but it's fine. Okay. It still tastes delicious. She's really, I know she's so tiny, right? I know she's so little. She don't taste so little. She's so little. She's so little. You're talking about how short you are. <laughs> we don't have Dr. Brown come, so she's right. so tall. <laughs> so we're gonna do the shrimp first. We'll do, this, we'll do the shrimp last because shrimp, um, Takes less time to cook. That's what I'm gonna do. Next Just gonna stir it on in. Come with some sweats, man. I should have told you though. My bad. We got that in there. And of course, I have my Miss E cooking with Miss E. Handy dandy. So I'm gonna put these right on in the far. I'm gonna put them right on in the far. Right on in the far. 
I'm gonna put on my glove because I'm gonna put my hands in here, y'all. Cause I like a nice and battery. <laughs> Better. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Can you open that for me, my love? Is it gonna be hot? It is hot. The top's not hot, though. Wow, how's that possible? Cause it's oh, not. you're frying it. I'm frying it. You got what? Yeah, show Nice and battery. See that? See how that batter sticks on there like this? It's that beer batter, y'all. Ear. Are you gonna fry the shrimp, too? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I am. So why not a skillet? Why, why that thing? I mean, I just love my Dutch oven. Oh. You love the coffee? Now, but, but yeah, tell, see, tell, them the, um, tell them about the, um... Uh, you know what? Get a meat tenderizer? I have one. I like doing it that way. You talking about what, babe? Tell them about the K-Cups with the coffee. Oh, yeah. When you use a K-Cup, you've got to... Rinse it first. You've got to remember to rinse it. And I would go so far as to say... Because if you use a K-Cup, it's going to shoot a stream of water down like this. What I would do is I would take it and I would saturate that coffee around here because you'll get a, a, a more uh, full and bold taste because if it just shoots straight, straight through, you're gonna get a weak uh, continence on it. What's up, Ohio? So um, so wet it with the K-Cup and if you want wet the, uh, um, the grounds itself. Hey, Tammy Faith. Tammy's on uh, YouTube this time. Oh, is she? Mm -hmm. Hey, Tam. No, I didn't attend Mizzou. My, um, my younger son played football there. Vaughn, please step aside. Why? I'm working. Okay, we're going to let that cook. Bop. Bop. A little top on there. Wait, I can it stir around a little bit. It's not full. That's why I'm doing this. I probably put too many in there, sorry. You want some more grease? Nope. You're gonna need hot. There it is. So if, if that cooks fast, so why am I not cooking the steak now? You can cook the steak now. You said you wanted the hot. I put too many in, but it's alright. Mm-hmm. You didn't know such thing now. So Alright, so I'm gonna where are the tongs? You got them? Is I have them right here. Where's another set? Uh in there somewhere. Okay. So while we're doing that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the chili lime cilantro coleslaw. I'm going to put these shrimp in there because that's not going to take but a second to cook. I'm going to stir this in there. Okay, so I'm going to take this is this is a, a bag of shredded um, cabbage. Is I didn't cut it and shred it myself because I guess I'm lazy. So what we're gonna do is we're going to squeeze a whole lime in here. And even though I marinated the steak in olive oil, I'm gonna baste the, the pan a little bit with it just to make sure. We get these out. Of it. Cause we don't like burnt food. Well, no, we don't like burnt food. It's down too low, actually. And people make mistakes in the kitchen like I just did. So? Cause that's too much breading right there. There's no editing here. This nope, is, there's not. It's just straight up. It is what it is. So this is what the steak looks like. Marinated, it's dripping olive oil, which is always a good thing for me. Get it, Mike? There. All right. Mm -hmm. So while he's doing that, I'm going to add some more lime juice. Hey, from London. Nice. In the middle of the night there, that's dedicated bacon. What's this? That's uh, too much. Um, I'm adding uh, more lime because I don't like squeezing like that. Yeah, cod. No, that is breading. Oh, and this is 
cilantro. You can add as much or as less as you want to. I like cilantro. My sister Trace used to call it cilantro. Now you can add as much or as little red onion as you want. I'm just going to sprinkle some on there. And... I'll tell you what, if nothing else, the kitchen smells great. We got cilantro, lime, garlic. It smells great in here. Mike, don't take pictures of my refrigerator because it's dirty. It's not dirty, it's not dirty but it's, it's definitely I just, crowded. I just bleached that whole thing. It is not dirty. It's crowded and lived in. Oh, there you go. Bleached the whole thing last week. So I'm going to add in some. This is whole milk plain Greek yogurt. Okay? I'm just going to add some of this in there. About a half a cup. Hey, is this where the... Mm -hmm. About a half a cup of that. And I like to add, it's called crema. It's not sour cream. It's just, it's just, it's Mexican cream. Okay. So we're going to add in a half a cup of this too. Squeeze that in. And then we're not going to stir it. We're going to massage it. Why? Because that way you get everything all up in there. Just get all up in it. Just get all up in it. Maybe you have a little keep some salt and pepper. Yeah, which kind of salt? Uh, that, that, a kosher sauce kind that we had. How much pepper? I'm doing pepper first. I'm not going to You can't do it, you can't do it for me. And one, and two. That's two. Another one. Mm-hmm, and some salt. Let's go ahead and pour it in. Don't be, don't be scared, don't be scared. It's not going to bite you. Don't be scared, don't be scared. Don't be scared to season your food. I'm turn this down a little bit. That might be done, actually. Yeah, I know. Because you don't have to. Hurry, hurry, hurry. I'm kind of massage it real quick. One and two. Mm. Dump it, just dump it, just dump it. There we go. We want to massage it. Don't be scared to use God's utensils. <laughs> Your hands. We're going to so, massage this all in there real good. So, Dr. Key. Okay? Massage it on in. I can smell that yogurt. It smells really good. Some people, when they make a steak, they'll only flip it once. First off, my steak is going to be more dead, medium well plus than most people. Um, but I like to flip it and continue to, so you can do it gradually. Because if you only flip it once on either side, you got to get it right. And I'm not, that exact, burnt. That's and I'm not that exact, so I'm going to make sure that I keep flipping down the floor. I need that turning on. I messed up my fish. You do me a favor. Back that door. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's this, a piece of fish? It is. Nice. It's good. Let me get some comments. Hold on. Victoria Clark, thank you. Yeah, I'll put thank too many pieces the, in there. The super thank you. Trying thank to hurry you. up. Put too many pieces in there. I got to taste this. Tina's testimony. How are you doing? Valerie Lofton, hello. Watch out, Vaughn. Hello, London. Hello. Hey everybody. Okay, now we have to taste it. Come on. Us. Watching from Maryland. Taste what? I do need some fitted gloves. Oh, do you want to eat all of it? I can't taste it. You don't need to. It's perfect. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Good job. Wow. Matter of fact. Y'all. Come here. <laughs> Y'all too. Come here. Y'all. It might need a little bit more lime, a little bit more, um. Good something like, oh, 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 no, no, I need, need a little bit more lime, a little bit more salt and pepper. Wait, wait, put some lime and salt and pepper in. Salt and pepper, salt and pepper, salt and pepper. You're not going to need more of your house your way. Trina, look at me. Trina. It tastes fine. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's too much. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. And then just throw it in the sink. Mmm. That's good. That's what we want to tie those. Just throw that in the sink and you're done. Mm. 
That's good. Does it need more yeah. salt and pepper? You gotta go on the screen, brother. Yeah. Mm. Any more pepper? That is good. Does it need no. more salt and pepper? I'm good. It it Your wife said need more pepper. Pepper? So just put some pepper on top of yours. So, all right. So now I'm gonna go check on this food. I know. She said she didn't say that. <laughs> yes, she did say it. <laughs> yes, you did, sis. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, everyone always asking Vaughn and I, how did we meet? Yeah. So today we're gonna check. And we have several couples with us, and I guess they'll tell us how they met you. They will. Y'all done messed up, I messed up this uh, fish, I ain't gonna lie. Oh. Cause put too much in there. Clump together. Yeah, man, but it's okay. It is. We're gonna make it work. I did. I messed it up. I did. I'm just trying, trying to be cute, trying to be fast. I put too much in there, and but we we, we had to live with it. Okay. We're gonna break it apart. And we're gonna eat it. It doesn't we, matter. Because it's gonna taste the same. It's gonna taste good in our mouths. Mmm. Watch my hands. Hey, babe, can you put the uh that yogurt away? Yeah. Please. Oh, is this the top? The see-through top. No, that's weird. This is, this is yogurt. It is yogurt. And I'm going to tell you guys something about um, with yogurt. You can use it for so many different things. You can use it when you're like, when you're baking bread, when making biscuits and things like that. So instead of adding like milk and things like that, you can add in the, um, the, the Greek yogurt and it tastes so delicious. It almost makes it like a sourdoughy kind of thing. It's so good. So I'm just telling y'all. And then um, oh, I made man. this. I made this chimichurri sauce earlier today, and that's going to go on his steak. It's going it to um, go on everything. That's it, 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 it tastes good. It really so this is this is homemade chimichurri. I made this earlier. So another day, I'm going to show you guys how to make it. Explain what chip. Well, I've never heard of it before. So yet. chimichurri is cilantro based. Okay. So it's cilantro, parsley, red wine vinegar, shallots, um, lots of garlic. Lots of garlic in here and olive oil. Uh, what else is in there? A little bit of salt and pepper. And this right here, you can write home to mama about this one because this is every what thing, but it will mess up date night because it's very garlicky and don't, don't talk in nobody's face after you've had it. So if you're going on the first date with somebody, please don't order chicken. Thank you. Don't because it's nice and garlicky. You're welcome. For all you garlic fans out there. Okay, so babe, that's um that's finished. Yeah, I got you. Alright. Yeah. I think I can take a few more of these out. Nope, I can't. I I I have ruined it. You didn't ruin it. Yes, I huh. Watch it get eaten still. Ouch. It will. Yeah. But yeah. it's still ruined. How so? Because I, I put too much in there. I'm trying to be cute. Trying to be cute. Trying to be efficient. Trying to be cute. Trying to be cute. That's what I get. Trying to be cute. Trying to be cute. And that's not cute now. At all. But we'll fix it with the shrimp. Alright, so I'm gonna tell y'all how um Vaughn and I met. He fell in love at first sight. And I'm not mad at him. You, you not be lying on the internet. <laughs> Enough of that. How, how do you say? How do you say we met, Vaughn? Well, I mean, the fact. I had a, a guy that I was working with down here. And he said, I have somebody for you to meet. And I'm like, all right, cool. I didn't think much of it. And he kind of he kind of pressed the issue. He said, you guys would be good together. And, and I have to say this. He has a knack for stuff, certain things about knowing people that fit in business or whatever. I didn't know that at the time, but I'm like, all right, fine. So he had a dinner where he had us come over and his wife cooked and we met. And I thought she was cool. I love you, Angie, but you can't cook, sis. And them pork chops are just anyway, but it was it was the, the conversation and the and the and the company were good. But um so we exchanged numbers and we just started talking, and the next time we went to a movie, right? The four of us went to a movie, mm -hmm. and then right, I sat in the car until you opened my door. Don't say that. That she, happened. Okay, here's, here's what that happened. happened. Here, it did happen, but here's why: she was on the phone talking to 
a bunch of different people, lawyers or whatever. So when I got out of the car, I was standing there. I was just waiting. I thought I was giving her privacy. And then when I finally looked, her hands were down. And she couldn't have been talking on Bluetooth because it was my car. So um, I'm like, are you waiting on me? She's like, yeah. So I let her out. So we went to see a movie. And oh, then, you, oh, you let me out? What was I in a cage? I let, I let her out? The car. Anyway, for the same people, I let, I let her out. Um, and then we went to the movie. And then she had to leave the movie because she was... Talking on the phone to lawyers or whatever. He, he thought I was talking to another dude. I hey, did. Umba. I did. And at that point, I didn't care. I'm like, okay, I know what this is. Yes, oh, about the uh, hood rich one and two. My sister Tawanda is in that movie. Please watch it. It's amazing. Tawanda, tell them where they can watch it, please, on your platforms. And now you can go ahead and finish lying. So she ended up walking out of the movie a couple of times. And then after that, we went to this restaurant that anybody in Atlanta... Up here, up north, anyway, should try. It's called Cotton Calf. It's in downtown Browsing. It's Incredible. so good. Incredible. So we went there, and then I think the next time I came in town, these are like consecutive weeks because I was down here working. So the next week, she invited me over, and I told the story about how she had all these pictures downstairs with Tony Braxton, and I thought she was a super fan because I didn't realize. I am a super fan. Yeah, but I didn't realize that she was related to Tony. Um, and we got a good laugh out of that. And then the next time we were supposed to go out, but I was busy. Actually, I got, I came here and then we went to like Savannah or, yeah, we went to Savannah or no, Augusta to work. And then, um, so I ended up seeing her on Sunday as I was leaving town and we had French fries and wine. And how cute is that French fries and wine? Like, yeah. Cause I had a nine hour drive back. So. Um, we just had that, and then I left. Okay, wait, wait. What he left out was this, though. So, when he came when he came over to the house, and we were downstairs talking, you saw that quote unquote shrine, which is not just Tony; it was all the Braxton I stuff. Know, I didn't know your. I didn't know that. It was all Braxton stuff. All Braxton. Stuff. But guess what he said? I'm gonna tell you what he said to me. He was like, "You know, next time I see you, you gonna give me a kiss." You yeah, remember you said that? that? Yeah, I did say that. <sighs> next time I want one now, but next time I want one. I, I mean, and it was awkward because you demanding kisses and stuff. Because I did not kiss him the first time or the second time I met him. I Thank you very you much. Either. I didn't want one. But you, you can't kiss me without me kissing you back. You, Life, can't, you, can't, you can't just kiss on people. I didn't know if I want. What? I thought it was ruined. No, it's not. It's not? No. That was good. So you get nice and flaky. Mm -hmm. So anyway, after he was like, because he, he looked down on me, he was like, can I give him a hug? He was like, <laughs> next time I see you, you're going to give me a kiss. I said, okay. I said, next time I see him, I'll kiss him. And so next time he saw me, he kissed me. And he was, kissed me back. It was cute. Whatever. You liked it. You liked it. You kept coming back. You You're the one drove nine and a half hours to come and see it. Come get it. You kept opening that, that's the your new name. Come get it. And you kept opening the door. Didn't I? <laughs> yeah. And now the door stays open. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, but we were talking the other day, and the question is, I was down here so much it wasn't really um, long distance, but I had one before. But it was long distance. It kind of was. But the question to the panel, to the gallery is... Somebody said, bring Shantae back. She coming. We, no, because we're going to... You let us do this. Um, I'm not short. I'm just short in comparison to him. Um, the question is, could you do a long-distance relationship? You did. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. So are you. I'm, I'm welcome or what? You're welcome. Like, st stand up straight, babe. Stand up. See? It's not that bad. Mm -hmm. I'm not, Shantae's the one that, Shantae, come here. Yeah, let's get them in here. Both of y'all come over here, matter of fact. I'm tired of doing everything. Look, it's stair steps. <laughs> so, like she could get in front of me. I'm still the same. Y'all like the same height. Here's what we yeah, gonna do. Well, here's what we gonna do. Here's what we gonna do. <laughs> Tell everybody how y'all met. Oh, uh, yeah, while I, while I get my, my food, yeah, this is your story. How we met? Yeah. All right, so 26 years ago? 
Wow. How long have you been there? No. 20, 29 years ago. Oh, no, we've been married 26. Yeah. We've been married 27. Oh. 27. Okay. Oh, get, get it right. Get it right, G. Excuse me. Get it right. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, so 29 years ago, um, my roommate said, hey, this nice looking young lady want to meet you and she wants to go out for lunch. And we said her favorite place is Shoney's or something like that. So <laughs> she likes to eat Shoney's. And I took her out to, to lunch. Buffet, y'all. Cheap. Mm -hmm. oh, uh -uh, yeah. Give it to a buffet. Buffet. Yeah, I was, I was Buffet. 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 It was definitely Buffet. <laughs> and uh, Shoney's was off the chain back then, though. That Shoney's. Well, college, yes, it was. Yeah, so, well, college, you're going to eat all yeah, your kids. Yeah, We're 20, yeah. what, 23? 23. Yeah. Man, they're, yep. they're, they're French folks. Three. Incredible. Yeah, so um, took her out. To, oh, thank you. She looked 29. Which, which Buffet did y'all go to? Shoney's. It's in um, Nashville, Nashville, Tennessee. Nashville, we had Shoney's. Nash yeah. Nashville, Tennessee. Yeah. And uh, we went out. For the first time, and I guess we've been together ever since, right? Ever since. I can't get rid of her. All right. All right. He doesn't want to get rid you of her. You see that? I know that's I what it is. Y'all look fucking good. Uh, oh, thank you, whoever said we look good. Yeah, I can't get rid of her now, so um, 20, yeah. 29 what? years ago. 29. There's nothing out there. Well, what? There's yeah, what? Is nothing out there. There's really nothing out there. There's nothing out there. Well, I don't want to go anywhere. I'm staying. I'm staying. So. I'm and thank you guys for having us. Oh, thank you. For oh, but, but no, but but thank you. And it's open now. If you just want to stop on Monday, just come on through. We are always <laughs> sure. cooking extra food. So if you're bored, just stop through seven o'clock. All right, we'll take you up on that. Yep. But look, but back then there was nothing out there. Beautiful, like, beautiful now couple. Is, there's like really nothing out there now. Beautiful like, couple, Miss Shoney's. Yeah, I miss Tony too. Beautiful you, couple you guys, again. Wait, wait, do you guys remember Bob's Big Boy? Y'all remember yes. that? Yes. Y'all look, huh? really, look really yeah. great. That's part of the Shoney family. Oh, wow, tw that's 22 years. Tina's testimony. 22 years for you. Oh, my gosh. Congratulations. congratulations. Wow. They said y'all don't look more than 29 years old. Yeah, you guys. Aw, look at us. Lovely black love. Y'all are, are 50 yet, They you? look great. Yeah, Kate Hoops brand. Okay, bet. Hey, K Hoops brand, what do you sell? You say K Hoops brand, what is that? Yeah, I know that. It's, people keep saying it's blurry. I'm sorry. Because somebody said everyone's older than Dr. Brown. Ah! That's, that's very true. I'm a teller. <laughs> she said she was coming today, too. Oh, is she? She said she was. All right, so. Babe, stop eating the fish. We're not going to have I'm any more tacos. I ate that one piece, babe. Come on. I didn't, I didn't do that. You made them too big. They, I, they can crumble up. Hold on. Start. It's like each crumble is like one taco. That's true. You're breaking the heart. Wait, wait, wait. What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? I'm drinking. I'm drinking. No, no, no. Paper towel. What do you mean? Put it on this. Well, what? What? Put on this and then let it rest for a second so you can cut it up. Well, that's what I was going to do. There. Put it on there and then we're going to let it rest. This is, your this is Bond's steak. Bond, you show your own steak. Thanks after you already did it. And this, I got this from Nikki, Chef Nikki, my friend. This is a cool ass cutting board. Cause this stuff is perfectly seamed in together. I don't know how they did it, but it's It's beautiful. Nice. She got it for me for, for I'm turning I'm turning this pot off there. Get your little neck off of my food. Alright, the shrimp are about to go in. Got all the cod. All the cod. All the cod. All the cut. Your high school sweetheart in you 12 years. Congratulations. Wow, that's amazing. My son is about, my oldest son is about to marry his high school sweetheart. I married mine and I'm divorced from him. Well, I would hope so. Z O U. M I Z. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with those. No, it's not. It's not. You just cut them in half. Yeah, it's not, but, you know, but it is. It's not the way I wanted it to be. This here? Shrimp, we're going in. I didn't, I didn't know she could make coleslaw. I had no idea. You know I can make coleslaw. I didn't know you could make coleslaw, no. You've never made coleslaw since we've been together. Well, yeah, that's true. You don't, I didn't know you liked it. I don't really. I like this one, though. I mean, it's okay. You know, because you didn't even make it when you made those... She had this hot dog that she kept saying I had to try, and she described it to me. Mm -hmm. And it was, what, is it, what did it have on? Coleslaw, cheese, mm -hmm. um, 
uh, mustard mayonnaise. And it sounded, it sounded terrible. And so I lost a bet to her. I can't remember what it was, but I lost, and so I had to have one. Best hot dog I've ever had. You know what that bet was? You know exactly what that bet was. No, I don't. Mm-hmm. The same Sylvia bet that you Simon. always give me. Thank you. No. Huh? Uh, Janet, I married a neighborhood boy. It's going to be 41 years in June. Congratulations. Yay! Come on, love. I'm here for the love. Where is the love? Where is the love? Y'all know about write, that song? Write a list of the things that I like to eat that my wife can cook. It's just, Everything, because he doesn't know he likes it until I cook it. That's true, because most of, most of the stuff, I'm not, I don't really like trying new things. Like when I go to restaurants, I typically go to the same one. I order the same food. They're over there. and over and over and over. There, there are restaurants I've been to and I've only had one thing there. Because I, because the thing I hate more than anything is going to a restaurant. There's two things I hate. One is going to a restaurant and being dissatisfied with my food. The other is going to a restaurant, being dissatisfied with my food, and the person I'm with enjoying the hell out of there is I hate that. <laughs> so I just always get the same thing. If I find something at a restaurant that works, that's what I get. But the funny thing, he asks me, like, Trina, what do I like from here? Like, dude, I don't know what your taste buds feel like right now. No, well, no, well, they, they feel the same, but I just, we go to so many places, I can't remember what I like at what places, so. That makes sense, right? No, it does not. Is and just, just Judy said, but don't make sense is a lie. What? He, he just wants me to order for him. What? That's really what it is. Okay, I think you're... I didn't say it. Judge Judy said it. Judge Judy. I didn't say it. I never met Judge Judy. I'm not talking with him. You're like that too? All right, baby, it's time to slice up your steak. Okay, well, go ahead and do it. Okay, now when I have to do that too, give me a fork, please. Mm-hmm. All right, let me cover the shrimp. Because it's only going to take just a few minutes for those. I just need a fork. I need a fork. I need a fork. I need a fork. All my utensils and stuff are clean. I just like to rinse everything off. So just, I'm just saying. That's just what I do. Okay? So before y'all start talking about people. And if they do, they can leave. No, hold that. Here, I'll take one of these right here. Of course you will. No, well, it's mine. So. It's not all yours. Like, you have to share. This is how I like my steak cooked. I want all the peak gone. He wants it to look like cardboard on the inside. No, I don't. But I want all of it gone. Well, mission accomplished. Look all the way down to the back. Perfect as usual. But it looks good, though. It's perfect as usual. Bam! Feel that. Oh, I mean, can you bend any further? Yeah, yeah I killed it. It's incredible. Taste it yourself. I, I mean... Taste it yourself. I mean, he's I in love with himself right now. He is like in love with himself right now, right? When I kill my steaks, I told y'all. I, I like I like mine to be a little bit more pink on the inside. You have to taste it because I taste all yours. You taste it. I will taste it. Give me a segundo. Right okay, it. move. Eat it. Eat it. Jeez, old blitz. Here, I'll give it to you. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, oh. That empty somewhere. Oh, damn. Mm. Mm. I told you, I got four things I can cook. Mm -hmm. That's one of them. Yeah. Well, look, she's quiet. Imagine that. He did that. I'm like, mm. wait. Mm. I told you. I told you I killed it. But the fine. The steak was good. Forty-three years. Congratulations! Yay! Nice, nice, nice. I like a little bit of pink. So this. See this? Mm -mm. I like mine like that all the way through. Sometimes a little bit more red. I won't eat that. I would, I would either put that in the microwave so, or I'd discard it. I wouldn't eat that. Discard, don't, you would not discard a steak. You would not discard a steak. Well, I'll take it home and like I did. So when we were in uh, in Maryland. Shrimp were almost done. I had a steak, 24 ounce ribeye. And I told him I wanted it medium well plus, right? Mm-hmm, oh, that happened the other and day, it came, yeah. And it came out bleeding. I sent it back, still bleeding. I sent it back, third time, came back bleeding. I'm like, I got it. So I took it back to the condo that we were staying in and, mm -hmm. I, and I cooked it myself. I put it in the oven, a little olive oil, and it was perfect. 
Here, you can eat these. Look at these three. They're pink. Do I use an air fryer? You know what? Yeah, I have an air fryer, and I have the kind of has like little French doors and stuff on there. But you said you wanted this to be hot. Start making steak tacos for them. I will. Start, well, I will start making the tacos. Okay. So, I'm, I lost my train of thought. Air fryer. Damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just I can't seem to get the temperature right for some reason. This is like, wait, what's what's going on with this little air fryer? So I'm like, I'm not doing it. Let's get them the steak. Okay, and so. Um, this is mango peach salsa. Y'all, let me tell you something about this. Everybody doesn't want like that sweetness with their um, tacos and stuff. But let me tell you, with this cilantro lime and this salsa, I got this from K. Roger. Or Kroger. And he says Kroger. I say K. Roger. That's where I got it from. But it's this particular brand that is every what thing. Everything. Every what thing. What did you buy this for? So you, can, so you can wash the dishes. So she bought this spring. I, I don't trust this spring. Well, you and your Don don't need to... Well, Don takes grease out of your way. So let me get some spoons and stuff for this. So people can come in and eat their tacos. Yeah, I'm anxious, I'm anxious rinse, to get that. Rinse, 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 rinse. So you guys are going to have steak first, then cod. Steak first, then cod, then shrimp. And if you use too much, you can share one, but... So if everybody just wash their hands, they can make their own stuff. No, make theirs. I'm not. Okay, I'm not. And then I use this Spanish cheese. Cotija. Is everything open? All right, come on over. I get this from K. Roger as well. I like that K. Roger. Y'all have never been here. You don't have to. Be quiet back there. You just talk. You can talk. Look, every man for himself got for himself. Hey, all right, it's all. Do your thing. You get out of your way. There's a water if you want to let your hands off. Go ahead. Ooh. Wow. Are you really watching Whack. sports? Yeah, I'm watching sports. Yeah, yeah the game's on it. The tournament. That's the winner. That's right? cheap. Yeah. Okay. You're wrong. Where? You know, where that is. And this and this one is finally um. This one is finely grated. Sometimes you can get it like um, kind of chunky, like feta and blah, blah, blah. I like this. And just um, sprinkle it on. Somebody said, oh, yes. Well, My baby sister out. noticed me. Her song is oh, on all got Your saucers here. And just give them, give them the pita thing, babe. What's the pita thing? The, 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 they have the thing you put the top away. Oh, she's doing paper. Oh. Okay. 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 So, what, are, what are the steps? Trina, you're going to I can can I get the shrimp? I, can I get the shrimp? I'm not talking about you when I say shrimp. <laughs> She's like, I'll get the shrimp. I'll get direct. I don't no, 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 no. Okay, just give it a second. Because if I do it, it's going to be wrong. Yes. No matter how right it is. Why is it sticking in here? This, I'm, 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 this is not frying in here anymore. I'm not frying in my Dutch oven anymore. Okay. It doesn't come out the way I want it to. Regular skip for me. Yeah, I can, just from my oxtail and stuff. I think it's cooking all sides. Yeah, it's like, mm-mm, I don't like this. I think it's gonna be fine. It's I mean, it's already fine and stuff, but I'm just saying, it's like, I don't like it. It's sticking. Well, just start taking them out, right? Maybe you soak some in. Yeah, I'm, I promise I'm working on it. You want me to do it? No! Cod's gonna be cold. Huh? Cod's gonna be cold. Well, then they can make their cut. You know what? This, but you got to direct them. I just need, I need two more minutes. Okay. So, pick a. There's a flour and there's corn for the street tacos that we're making. Okay, get your. You want, you want flour or you want flour. corn? Okay, we'll go ahead and get your. Open it up. Open. Which one do you want? Do you want flour, flour. or flour? Yeah. Okay. We just put it on the same plate. I think we can splurge for two yeah, plates. Yeah, I think we can. I, th I think we can get two plates from it, y'all. I think, I think so. You think so? Mm-hmm. Yeah, brother, you gotta get your own. Yeah, my brother, you got to get your own. Twenty-nine <laughs> years, you can't make one. No. Nope. Oh. <laughs> so you're gonna, you're gonna Let me steak. do it for the gram. Y'all gonna start with steak? What would you gram. like, honey? Steak, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love that mango. Put it on the. Uh, put it on here. Mm -hmm. Okay. How many? Slides? You can have. You can have more than one. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. This is for him. I'll do it. Jeez, on blitz. 
Yeah. Just a, just a little bit of this. You only need a little bit because a little goes a long way. Just a little goes a long way. Okay. So you use yogurt in the... Yeah. I did. You want the peach sauce? Oh, yes. Yes, please. You want more onion or no, you're good? I'm good. What hot sauce? What's you that? want hot sauce? Absolutely. But you ain't taste it yet to know if you need hot sauce. Oh, I like spicy. Don't mess up her food. So you have to taste it on here. Oh, I got to taste it on here? Not a problem. This is the steak one. Okay. All righty. Bonnie's tasting your steak. Mmm. Really good. What's real good? I tell you, that. what is this? Cilantro or what? Cilantro lime slaw. That with the um, the mango salsa mm -hmm. mixed together. Mm -hmm. That's uh, that's hitting. Uh huh. Then with the coleslaw, it gives it a di another different texture too. So it's yeah, this is this is. And see, some people are really scared to try different right. flavors no, together. This, I love it. This is banging. All right, since so you gotta try it. All right, what am I trying? This is banging right here. Yes. You have a fish allergy? He does. Okay, well, good. Then we're gonna let you do that then. Right. You stay over there. <laughs> what do you think about the um, the green sauce, the chimichurri sauce? That's what I'm saying. That is great with the steak. Oh, absolutely. That that really sets it off, though. Okay, what am I doing? Which one do you want? I guess I want steak. What do you do? I want fish. You fixed his. It's different. Oh, I'm sorry. Girlfriends. Ow! Eh. Ow! Steak. Okay. Can I know the step? So I just just dump it on I here. I thought that maybe you watched. Okay, I'm sorry. Coleslaw. Wait, the chimichurri sauce. Oh yeah. See. Got See, I messed up. Now. You didn't want to help. Why you only one piece of steak? Cause that's all I want. A drizzle. Mm-hmm. What says she's shy? LOL. I am shy. You gotta get that mango. That mango. Is that it? I mean, that is really sparse. Two, two, two pieces of steak, though. Not one. It's not sparse. Oh, yes, let me know about the whole lupus thing, because we, we give for lupus. I'm not shy. It's good. Because if it's nasty, you have to tell us. I'm not going to tell you it's nasty. Because it's good. Am mm -hmm. I looking in the camera? It's good. I'm going to try some of that fish. Okay. We I thought oh, you have fish allergies. Shellfish. No, but shrimp. you have the shrimp on the uh, on the fish. Okay. Yeah, put yeah. that. Mm -mm. Okay, let me keep eating. Mm -mm. Well, y'all. Well, it didn't touch over here. Right here, it didn't. You can I, eat I, I want to. I can eat. If it didn't touch, yeah. What question do they have, Trina? What 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 question do they have? Where's girl? If you don't get another, another piece of. Steak. <laughs> You sure is hungry. Let me see. No, it's plenty. I love salsa verde, but this is better than salsa verde. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. No, another piece it's of better. Steak. But I'm, I'm with Vaughn. I think you can put this. What is this called? Chimichurri. Chimichurri. I'll put Chimichurri. it on everything. Yeah, Chicken. Yeah. Bread. This is but, but you, you taste how garlicky it is. Though. It, yeah, you it, can it, taste it. It'll, it'll mess up day Get night. the recipe and try it. It's really good. Well, we're doing the chimichurri sauce another day. You didn't put the cheese. You didn't put the, the, the cheese on it. Cause you didn't tell me. You didn't help me. Honestly, I don't, I, need, I, no, I don't even know if you need to oh, on that. See, I followed the instructions. With that right there, that is fire, though. The chimichurri is everything. That is fire. Then with the mango, salsa really. I'm, I'm I'm trying to wait for Bond to come back. <laughs> so, right, the taco is skinny. Right, you need you need more. It's on not there. skinny. It is. That's thin. Oh, the two little, pieces is little, just, little struggle taco. I, just enough. I have two pieces of steak. But you got a struggle taco. I'm sorry. You're struggling. I'm really not. Her taco struggle, y'all. <laughs> I'm really not. Can I get out of the camera? Yes, you can get out of the camera. You got something in your hands. But don't you want another taco or something? I want the fish. Over here. Don't, be gonna make, don't, don't come over here getting sick and shit. The, fish, over the fishermen's. Over there. Right here? Mm-hmm. That's lots of, yeah, that's lots of cotton. So mm -hmm. It'll soften up once you put everything on there. You all right. All right. You don't have to crumble stuff up. 
and I'm, that I'm, taco I'm, I'm putting this good. on here. You can put whatever you want on there. That chimichurri sauce is everything, isn't it? I'm um, that on um, there. Um, um, uh. so what you think about it? You missed, you missed the whole thing. You missed it, no, huh? I, I can watch it. All right, so what else goes? The mango, peach oh, mango, yeah. and then the, the cotija oh, cheese. What? what do you want? Steak first. What do you want it with? Corn. That taco's hungry for more meat. Yeah, I mean, her. so which one you have first? Steak? Steak. What'd you think? Well, off the dick. It's in my belly, man. <laughs> yeah, the girl, the girl put some meat on that. Yeah, she well, had a. Was it didn't, she looked chain. like she had a struggle taco. Like, we ain't like had enough said, meat or right something. Here, uh -huh. You can put this on. I'll put it on the, on the fish, too. Yeah. That chimichurri is everything. You, you said you want corn tacos, babe? You want corn? Corn, babe. You want a corn and a. Uh, what? You want corn and flour? What? Oh. What? Say, say something. Say something about that crunch, that texture. Oh. Say something about oh. that texture, G. The texture. Say something about that texture. It's good. Phenomenal. You gotta have a crunch though. You gotta have a crunch. You need the crunch. You yeah. gotta have the crunch. Jennifer, Jennifer, Jennifer where, where are you? You gotta have a crunch on the fish okay. though. Now, I have to be honest, these little oh I forgot the limes for the squeeze the lime on there. Yeah, man. Oh. I forgot about that. That's all right, got another one. Let her let her taste her body yours. Let, watch out, she's short, so get out of here. <laughs> Get out, Everybody getting on you for that your short, man. Talking about you short, then you ain't eating no food. Right, so not eating. Okay, can y'all hear my crunch? The crunch is necessary. Give me that. Come on, Jen. The give crunch me that. is everything. Give me that. Give me that. Right. Come on, Jen. All right, come in. You better get it in. <laughs> come on, Jen. They're making me eat everything. They're making you eat everything. Oh, girl. Open up this cake soap. Coming in to help. Ooh, that looks so good. You got a line on mine. I'm about that to put lime on yours, dear. That chimichurri sauce. Did you put that on there? That's right? on there. And then he has his little lime on the side. Mm -hmm. Here, Vaughn. You try to pass it over here. Ah, oh, I feel like it was easy to do. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. What are you doing? Come over here, Jenna. <laughs> you got to taste it all. I'm going to. Did you let him see that? Oh, oh, excuse me, Jenna. Yeah. I got to show my face. You got to show the meal. There you go. This is the steak. And I did squeeze lime on mine. Oh, did I have my tacos? Could you back up? Could you? It's full. It was full. Girl. But don't talk over the food, though. Back up. What's wrong with my food? Was it delicious? Oh, my God. It's beautiful. Even in my, uh, my crops. Oh, cute. Uh, uh, is it, um, is it a, a, a spotlight? Got the spotlight. Yeah, when I'm not eating, I'll, I'll go ahead and do it. Okay, guys, so that's it. We have our... No, we don't need lettuce and tomato. No, hey, the street tacos. You don't, hey, yeah. you don't need any of that. Who did, who did the shrimp yet? Oh, they do the shrimp. Who going to do the shrimp? Oh, who going to do the shrimp? Okay, oh, oh, her husband has fish. Um, they don't do shrimp. They don't do shellfish. You got to have a shrimp, too. They don't do shellfish. They don't do shellfish. Yeah, he can't do shellfish. They don't do shellfish. They don't do shellfish. I, I, do, shellfish. Do, shrimp. Mm -hmm. I do shellfish. Bro, you can't eat shrimp? Uh-uh. Well, we gotta do shrimp. What, can you we kiss him, though? Shrimp. You can't kiss him? Yeah, I'm still trying to kill me. Uh-oh. Don't you be killing my brother! <laughs> <laughs> Give me two shrimps! <laughs> <laughs> Give me two shrimps! I need two shrimps! I need two shrimps! Y'all know about that. Hey, Dr. Brandy, I thought you were gonna be here tonight. Brandy, mm. Bond said that you said that you were coming over. So, yeah. So, but that, that's it, y'all. Mm -mm. Let her taste the shrimp on oh, But she can't kiss her husband. Let me make you do the taste. No, you do the taste, but don't kill my brother. Make me one. Nah, she's fine. She'll be, uh... Um, you want corn or you want the other one? Get some more margarita. Flour. Oh, yeah. So now he wants a flour one. Okay. That's why I didn't touch anything because I didn't this want anything. Mm -hmm. got Got to have a crunch. You have to have the crunch. The crunch is important. Shrimp. Mm -hmm. Shrimp. And because they're small, I'm just gonna put like that's, that's not it. Three's good. Just three little, just three little shrimp on there. Exactly. Put that chimichurri sauce on it. No, this is not for you. Okay. Yeah. You can make your own. He want, Vaughn wants chimichurri sauce on everything because the chimichurri sauce is everything. Give me that. Look at that. Perfectly done shrimp. Just a little bit of chimichurri on each little shrimp there. Make it cute. Keep it cute. Put it on mute. A little bit of the, little bit of the coleslaw. I mean, look at all the food we have. I mean, he's going to eat. That's it. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. A little bit of salsa. Because it tastes good. Mm, mm, mm. Lime? Lime. And here he goes. That Greek milk. I like the green. Yeah. I actually got to make the chili trees. I was at least. Mm. 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 Yeah, okay. You had it last time. All right. <laughs> Did you just bounce? Did you just? <laughs> you just bounce. He can't do a baby bounce on the job. <laughs> <laughs> this is as good as that taco we had. Um, In DC. DC. It's yummy, huh? Mm. You're wow. welcome, baby. All right, you guys. So there we go. I like coleslaw on my dogs too. Thank you. But coleslaw on your tacos, just, just make your own. It's really, it's really delicious. It's really good. And go ahead and try it at home. Watch it from start to finish. And don't forget, so after we're finished doing this, we always do like a, we're doing a behind the scenes table talk. So today we are talking about relationships. And go ahead and stay with us. And it's only going to be on YouTube. Only YouTube. Only on YouTube. So make sure you guys subscribe to our channel. Maybe a little bit on Instagram on mine, but not hers. Maybe because you know he always he's the king of going live. I don't know when that started happening, but it's just the way it is. But thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for your badges. Thank you guys for your donations. We really, really appreciate it because groceries are high. I almost spent I spent a whole lot of money at groceries, but when I used my K Roger Plus card, I saved fifty dollars today. Tell me about that. So, that dragon really, fruit thing. Yep. Yeah, oh, oh, because I bought some dragon fruit, right? Dragon fruit, they're like six, seven dollars per dragon fruit. And then with my Kroger Plus card, my K Roger card, it was $1.88 for the digital deals. So for those of you who like dragon fruit, right now it's $1.88 until tomorrow. So I think they, they, they changed their digital deals on Tuesdays. So get that because it was $20 at first and I was like $20. But then I made sure I had my digital coupon, $1.88. I'm not getting a dime from K Roger. I thought I would say that, but I like them. They're my go-to. So, uh, $1.88 right now. So, go out and get some. Those, these are the street tacos. I hope you guys enjoy them. Thank you guys for coming. At $6.99. That's what I'm saying. Oh, $6.99 for three? That's actually a good price. Are they the pink ones or the yellow ones, though? Because the pink ones and the yellow ones are two different prices. Just thought I'd say that. So. Lenita Vance. Hello. Hey, ringleader. Ski. Anyway, um, go get it. I hope you guys like it. Request it. Oh, and then um, tell me what you guys want me to cook. Because that makes my life a lot easier. And then tell us what you guys want us to talk about. That makes my life easy as well. Yes, you got to clip those coupons at K-Roger. And when you use it, when you keep using it, I got like, we got 60 cent off from gas the other day. 60. For our fuel points, we got 60 cent 60. off. Six cents. Cents. Off. I'm just saying. I like K-Roger. They're not giving me a dime. I don't have a horse in that race. But I like them, Whatever. and that's it. And oxtail, yes, I will be making oxtail on um, Easter. I well, might. Here's the thing, you, but because of the way that it, it cooks, we can't do it all because it's a four. Yeah, because it's four. It's four hours. So it takes me at least four hours. Tail end or something like that. We we'll have to figure it out because this takes too long. But it's delicious when it's done. Mm -hmm. And then, we'll, and then we'll take some of that oxtail and make tacos with. That part, boom. So thanks again for watching, you guys. I appreciate you guys. I will do a twist, on, a, a, a twist on shepherd's pie. So actually, that's a really good idea for me to do. I love lamb chops. I'll definitely do that new day vlogs um, and the mac and cheese. And uh, I love fried green tomatoes. I'll do that as well. So you guys just let me know. Like DM me, put in the comments for the YouTubers, things like that. The cheese thick sliders I can definitely do. So the more I get from you guys, the more I will cook for you guys. Mm -hmm. So um, Friday is four times crew once. It sure is. It has happily country farm it is. So that's all I'm saying. Stuffed peppers are delicious. So we can have all these things done. I can do a whole soul food meal with like peppers and what's wrong, bad boogie? Yeah. So thank you guys. I appreciate you guys. Peach cobbler for sure. How many times are you gonna thank them? It's like number five. But I am thankful. Mm -hmm. You gonna close it or you gonna keep? Why don't you close it then? 
Thank y'all for coming out. God bless. Good night. Whatever. You stole that from Russell Simmons. Of course I did. Okay. <laughs> so. <laughs>